everyone. That's the website of the San Francisco 49ers great inside linebacker Patrick Willis, a core member of an organization that has posted great wins and went to the NFC Championship. Is that a record? Nine? Three straight times? It's definitely a team, an organization record. Not an NFL record. You have to go back to the Green Bay Packers for that. But the bottom line is, Patrick Willis is retiring. He formed the first cog in what became one of the best linebacking cores in the history of the National Football League. When Navarro Borman was brought in, that solidified the 49ers linebackers as one of the best ever. And that combined with some really well-designed schemes were one large reason the 49ers were able to repeat appearing in the NFC Championship three straight times. That record ending last year, of course. So what now? Frank Gore shipped off to the, well, not shipped off, but allowed to be acquired by the Philadelphia Eagles. Former, former Fort Niner head coach Jim Harbaugh chased away to Michigan. Patrick Willis gone. And of course, there are rumors that Colin Kaepernick was going to be traded, but Trent Baalke came out and said that was absolutely ridiculous. What's going on in the 49ers? Are they disintegrating before their eyes? Or are these gentlemen simply being repl replaced or about to be replaced by others in the 49ers' effort to build from within? Time will tell. But meanwhile, Patrick Willis will be remembered as a great, steady player. No nonsense, no off-field issues. Just an incredible nose for the ball. Great speed, great intellect, particularly with respect to reading pass patterns that running backs were executing. And just a, a guy who had the ability to really, as they say, take his play to the next level, really turn it up a notch when necessary. Patrick Willis was that kind of big play guy. And he's retiring at just 30 years old to, to do the Lord's work, according to what I'm reading on his Twitter accounts and his other pages, like his Husay page, for example. Big loss for the 49ers. Big loss for the league. 